Hello and welcome to this course on Microsoft Office Specialist Certification. If you want to get a certificate from Microsoft for being a Microsoft Office Specialist, then this is the video you need to watch. I have created a complete series of videos to help you pass this exam. All these topics have been covered. And today we would be going over video number three, which is navigate within workbooks and search for data within a workbook. This is the important question and there are many ways in which this question can be put across to you. So in today's video, I'll be telling you how to answer the question when you face this question in the exam search for data within the workbook. So let us go to our Excel file. And now we will learn how to search for data within our workbook. Well, one of the easiest way is to do a control find press the control key and press the find key all right and you would usually see this kind of a screen now you can type in whatever you want to search like for example i want to search type it is written over here so i type type over here and this gets selected now i type credit okay so this got selected so this is the easy option now coming to the question that might be asked the question they might ask you find all the instances where credit is written so then you will type credit over here and select find all so now if you see you will be able to see all the instances where credit is written now they may ask you to go to any specific cell from here okay so then like to this cell so if i click over here i'll be taken to this one 161 161 now they can ask you to locate the find option on the screen so you go to the home tab and it is over here find and select okay you go to find easy right till here now let's go to certain advanced options over here if something is written in multiple sheets they might ask you to find this value in all the sheets all together. Now there are three sheets over here, correct? I have written my e-lesson over here. Over here I have entered a comment and this is the sheet that we are looking into. So this is one sheet, second sheet, third sheet, all right? And this whole combination of the sheet is a workbook. So if they say that find the word my e-lesson in the workbook, then you click over here you go to the options and this thing would open up and from within you select workbook now click next so it has found my e lesson over here see and now i'll type next it will go over here unless and until you select this option of workbook it will not go to the second sheet so this is a very important question that comes okay now Getting back to our main sheet, they may also ask you to search within comments. Okay, how to search within comments. So, for example, I have written the word subscribe. Okay, now in case you do like this video, then do please like the video and subscribe to our channel so that you get to know more about our videos. And whenever there is a new video out, you get a notification for it. Every week, I give out at least one or two videos. So I am clicking on subscribe and I have not changed anything over here. I click on next. We don't find that information, right? But I go to look in option over here and I type in comments. And we were able to locate it. See, in this comment it is written subscribe. So this is again an important question that they can ask you okay, to find something in comments. Similarly, you can find something in formulas also. Okay. And then you can find by rows or by columns. I'll explain this to you. This is very nice. It saves a lot of time also. Say, for example, they want you to find the word uh, credit. Okay. So I'm going to write credit over here also. And I'm going to write credit here also and here also okay now 
if I go ahead and do a control F and make it normal and type credit. So what it will do? Did I type something wrong? Okay, maybe what we are searching is in comments. Okay, so we need to select values. So credit over here, then it is taking me to credit over here and then it will take me to credit over here. Now, what if I only want to find credit in this column? Now, to search for some items in a specific row or column, you have to ensure that your control F options are set to sheet, all right, and set to values. Now, if I have written credit over here, over here, over here, and over here, and I want to search for credit only in this column, then I'll select this column by clicking on the top like this, pressing a control F, and I can do this away, and I'll type in credit over here, and search, see this got highlighted. If I press again, it is not going anywhere, it is not going to this or this. And in case I want to search by rows, then I will highlight this row by clicking over here, and then I'll do a control F, it will search for credit here, then it highlighted this, then it highlighted this. Easy, right? So this is how we can get the questions for doing a find or search in Excel. Now there is another important aspect. This is match case and match entire cell contents. Now, if I have written credit over here in full uppercase, and over here it is in normal case, right? To now search only this value, which is in full uppercase, then I have to do a control F. I have to click on match case. And then I have to type C R E D I T in uppercase. And it will be able to find this. If I type credit in lower case, then this would not be selected C. And now they might ask you to find content which matches exactly as it is written in a cell. Like for example, I have written credit not allowed over here. They want you to find only those cells which have exactly this written. If you search for credit, then everything which has credit written it would usually come back, correct? But I want to find only those cells which have written credit not allowed. So for that, I'll do a control F and I'll click on match entire cell contents. This is a very important question. Okay. And then I'll click on find next and it will find this. And if I click on find next, it will not be able to find anything. All right. So this is how this works. So this is how we search for data within a workbook, a very important topic to be covered in the Excel exam. I hope you like this video. Please do subscribe to the channel and like this video. Until the next video, this is your Guru now signing off for the day. Have a wonderful day ahead. Happy learning.